like sail away. Good morning, good morning. It's Wednesday morning. I think it is July 1st. We are officially in July. Excuse my appearance, I have not done my makeup yet this morning. And I am driving down the road. So, yeah. Forgive me. Um, oh, we're gonna go this way because I'm not getting stuck at this red light. Anywho, I hope everyone has been having a fabulous week. Um, It has been a few weeks, <laughs> probably, since I uploaded that last video. I can't keep up. <sighs> Anywho, I am here just to say hello again and just vlog. And I really don't have much to talk about, but I do have a little bit. Um, so I'm almost at work. I'll probably try to record a little bit at work, but people lately have been bugging me in my office and I haven't had the chance to record because I'm not gonna do it in front of people. So anywho, um, I do have a few things to talk to you guys about just to update you and let you know how I've been doing. And um, yeah, so, once I get to my desk, because I'm almost here, I will talk some more. Huh. The lighting's horrible in here. So, I still haven't done my makeup, but anyhow. I'm at work. Okay, so. Um, so, what am I want to update y'all on? Um, still having some... Um, stomach issues, well, digestive issues, um, with constipation. I'm probably, actually, I know that I am not drinking my water like I am supposed to. Um, I'm thinking about getting one of those cool water bottles that, like, not the gallon one, because that will just be ridiculous carrying that around at work, but I thought about getting, like, the half gallon one. And trying that. I don't know I am not the greatest at drinking my water I do buy the little flavor packets because I can't stand plain water um, but yeah still having that issue um, last week I started uh, fasting I start um, I decided to start at 5 p.m. every night and then run it until the next morning at 9 a.m. So that way, once I get to work, I can have my coffee and maybe some fruit or something for breakfast. I don't usually eat breakfast, but when I do, it's like grapes or apple or some kind of fruit. <sighs> and then I try to get, have my lunch. It's usually a big salad, but... I try to make it a pretty big lunch because I don't always eat dinner because I'm stop eating at five. So, but I've been bringing a little something to work with me to have before five o'clock. That way I'm not completely starving, but I'm doing good so far. Um, I weighed in this morning and I was at 250.4, um, which is the same thing I weighed yesterday. The scale didn't change much, but it's just one day so uh, we'll see how that goes but I'm kind of thinking that maybe it's because I'm constipated and it sucks <laughs> I've got to figure this out but um yeah so look this is what I'm staring at right now the friggin camera Ooh, I have better lighting like this though look at that Ooh. The cameras at work, you can see all the body shop and all the tow yard. Fun times. So I'm the first one here. No one else is here with me. So I had a chance to record. And I like to watch the cameras to make sure nobody's going to walk in and be like, who the fuck is she talking to? <laughs> Anywho, um... I guess I will try to take you along with me for this day. I probably will not on lunch because I go to lunch with my husband and yeah, he doesn't want to be in my video. Um, but if I get a chance in between, I'll try to update you on what I have for lunch. Oh, gotta go. I 
hope this is recording. Anyway, it's quiet again, so I have a moment to run my mouth some more. Um, back to the fasting thing. Um, I've tried the fasting thing before I started Weight Watchers. Um, and I think I tried it for about a month and I didn't see any results. But I didn't change how I was eating and I didn't work out. So I'm pretty sure that had a lot to do with me not losing any weight. So um, the reason I decided to try it while on Weight Watchers is because I was kind of hoping for um, a faster result because um, I am 37, a little over 37 pounds down. It's like 37 point whatever. And honestly, um, probably the entire time since um, March to now, I've worked out maybe three times. Um, so it's probably just because I was so large that just changing, excuse me, just changing my diet has helped me drop that much weight. But now that I've started fasting, I was kind of hoping that it would shove me in a um, losing more per week, but it has not. Um, but um, I do like it. I, I am a little hungry at night, but I tend to just distract myself with my phone and of course my two boys, they keep me busy. Um, and it doesn't really bother me like when I'm making dinner for my husband and the boys. Uh, yeah, I'm hungry, but I'm not like really tempted to cheat because in my head I know I'm fasting. And like I said, I try to eat something at work before five o'clock before I leave so that way I'm not completely starving. Because the first, hold on one second. Okay, somebody was coming, I'm sorry. Because the first couple of days when I started the fasting, um, I would just skip dinner completely. And it was harder because I was so hungry. Because literally I would, I ate my lunch at 12, between 12 and 1, and then I didn't eat again until the next morning at 9 o'clock. So that was a little hard. So that's when this week I decided to start bringing something with me to work that I could eat before 5 o'clock. That way I'm not just completely hungry. Um, but I like it. I'm going to try to keep it going for a little while. I don't think it's going to be something permanent, but... Um, We'll see. Um, and if you're also fasting or you have experience with it or you have some tips, um, then please comment down below or message me on Instagram or you can even email me. Everything will be down below in the description box. Um, yeah, so thanks. So what I was trying to say, um, I had to pause it because it looks like there's a parts person out there, so I'll probably have to help them. Um, what I was trying to say, I just get completely off topic and forget what I'm talking about. Um, I thought the fasting would speed up the process, but I guess n now that I've lost this much, I'm probably going to have to put a little more effort into it. Um, this is just what I'm thinking. You know, I'm not... I, I'm not a professional. I have no idea what I'm talking about, but um, I might have to step up my game and start trying to work out. Um, I do suffer from that. I'm probably going to butcher this, but I think it's called diastasis recti. Um, when you have kids or a bunch of kids, a bunch of babies, excuse me, your ab muscles stretch and you get a gap. Mine definitely do because I have this huge... Like, my last baby wa is three now, and my stomach still pokes out, like, if I'm still k k probably eight, seven months pregnant. Um, I'll try to um, put a picture here. So, yeah, 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 let me turn this off before I get a copyright to strike. Um, anywho, I hope I wasn't playing music the last. I have to check that. 
Anywho, um, sorry I keep getting interrupted. I'm at work and I'm the only one here, so it's kind of uh, hard not to deal with all the customers. Um, so yeah, I wish I could get these bright lights out of the top of the screen. Okay, that's a little bit better. Let me shuffle my butt over here. So, back to what I was talking about. Um, I found these exercises that I can do. I found them on uh, YouTube, of course, because it's the most fabulous platform ever. It's literally a video for everything on here. So I found these really simple and easy exercises I could do to try and correct my diastasis recti. So I think I'm going to give it a shot. Um, I... I'm trying not to be negative, but I just know with work and home that I have to really find the time to squeeze it in. But I'm going to work really hard to try to squeeze this in because I'm thinking if I could make it a regular thing that it's not, I'm pretty sure it won't be considered like a good enough exercise to probably promote any kind of extra weight loss but I feel like it would probably benefit me um, core wise and to strengthen these muscles back up in my gut so that literally my guts aren't like protruding out of my stomach which is pretty much what it is um, because your ab muscles get stretched and so all of your organs that are back there behind it are like you know just like busted out <laughs> that's terrible I shouldn't say that anywho you're probably thinking she's a freaking psycho it's all good anywho um I gotta get to work but I just wanted to talk a little bit and get you know give y'all a little update you know I always put a weight update at the end of my videos um I'm hoping that by the time I put it, publish this video I will have weighed in again I weigh in every morning um I just don't do it on camera because uh, I don't see the point um but I weigh in every morning so I always make a video of my weigh-ins so that way I can always document my lowest um my last weigh in when I do my videos so I'll be sure to post that at the end and um yeah um so I'll carry you along with me today hopefully I can get back in here and talk some more a little later I am going to go get me a refill of coffee because one cup just wasn't enough and I'm going to try to post some invoices so I want to go do payroll today so I'm kind of busy today um but yeah I'll check back later Oh, before I go, if any of you um, have any tips or experience with the diastasis recti exercises, or if you can recommend something, anything, you know, my email is down below. You could message me on Instagram or email me or comment down below and like. Okay, check back later. Hi, guys. So I decided that I wanted to, um, <clears throat> I had recorded a clip yesterday, but I was in my van and the air conditioner vent was blowing so loudly that uh, it was bad. So bad quality video, I'm not going to use that clip. Um, but anyway, I was just talking about, um, I was trying to clarify why I said in the previous part of this video that. I think I'm constipated because I'm not drinking enough water. Um, if you've been following my channel, you know I posted a video previously on how to, um, oh God, I can't even think this morning. It was a video about constipation and stomach issues and tips on how to improve that. So I'm aware of all that. I did do all that and my stomach was good for a while. I was ha having any issues, but then I just noticed recently that I am. And the reason why I said that it was probably because I wasn't drinking enough water is because that's the only thing that has changed with me. 
everything else is still the same, just I'm not getting in the amount of water that I previously was when I wasn't having any issues. So there's that, just to clarify that. <laughs> so um, it's Friday. I'm super excited. It kind of is a bummer that I had to work today, but it's all gravy. I wore, let me show you my cute shirt. I got this at Lane Bryant. Look, isn't it cute? It's like patriotic. Sorry, sorry, sorry. So I wasn't watching the cameras and someone totally walked in. So <laughs> forgive me. I'm sorry you can't see my face. But isn't this shirt just the cutest? If you can see it. It's like a really flowy. It is a tank top. But it's so patriotic. And I'm wearing it uh, for the 4th of July really. Because the, the, um, the fireworks got cancelled here in Duluth. Um, probably everywhere else too. I saw a couple of other posts on Facebook that said they had canceled their um, fireworks as well. So that's why I'm wearing this today since I won't get to wear it tomorrow. Yee. <laughs> uh, Lane Bryant is where I got it in case you're wondering. Um, what else did I want to tell you guys about? Oh, let me tell you. I don't know how in the hell. I don't know how it's possible. Okay, so like I told you guys, I had been fasting. Well, last night, my husband comes to me after we had already discussed it the night before and was like, hey, you want to do a date night? I didn't say anything, but I was like, sure, but I only have nine points left. So let me know ahead of time where you want to go so I can pre-plan my meal. Cool, no problem. He wanted to go to this barbecue place. I knew they had chopped chicken that I could have. No problem. Oh, well, we ended up going to a different barbecue place. So, I got a salad with barbecue chicken. It was just, I'm going to say it was probably no more than three ounces of chicken on that salad. So, I just felt like I was cheating. And I had ranch dressing with it. Not a lot. I would just take a bite, dip it in the cup. I didn't pour it, like, all over the salad. But, anywho, what I did was... Um, I'm going to have to finish this later because there's someone here. Give me time. So, sorry about earlier. I had to stop the video because work was crazy. And it was crazy the whole day. Anywho, um, if you hear noises around me, it's my cute little boys. They are in the room with me. So, bear with me. Um, uh -uh. Um, so, what I was trying to say is I was pretty, pretty sure that I went over my nine points last night. And I was like, oh, great. I just knew for sure this morning when I weighed in, I was going to have a gain. Just because the whole week I had been doing the fasting thing from 5 to 9. And then last night I chose not to and use my reigning points for dinner. And then I cheated a little bit. I felt like I cheated a little bit. But hey, the scale was down. So I was super excited about that. Um, yay. Um, I think I briefly told you what I ate. It was a salad. But it did have barbecue chicken on it. And I'm pretty sure it was not all white meat chicken. And um, I used some ranch. And it had some little crunchy onions on there as well. A little bit of cheese. But that was it really. The rest of the salad was all veggies. It had some corn on it. Some um, uh, regular onions. And I think that was it. Um, but anywho, scale was still down, so that's all that matters. I was super shocked, but super excited at the same time. So please, feel free to comment down below, to email me, to find me on Instagram. Share with me your super awesome accomplishment that you thought for sure you were going to gain, and then you didn't. I'd love to hear it. I would love to hear it. It's all, it's all great. Um, last thing I wanted to talk about before I end this, yes, was, um, my previous video, I mentioned that I was going to see my father on Father's Day and that I would, I was hoping that my sister would notice my weight loss. Well, she did. So I get there and, you know, I was there a little while before she said anything, thing, but I can't talk. But then she was like, you look good. Have you lost weight? And I was like, yeah. And she's like, what, what, are you, what are you doing to lose weight? And I told her I was doing WW. And she was like, that's great. It's working. Keep it up. 
Um, so, super excited that she did actually notice. My dad didn't say anything, so I don't know whether or not he noticed. You know how guys are. <laughs> but, um... I'm, uh, I'm in the video. But, uh... Close the door. But, um... But that was it. That was all I wanted to update you guys on. I hope you all had a fabulous week. I had a really long week. I am glad it is Friday and that I'm off this weekend. So... Y'all have a great 4th of July, and I will see you next time. Bye. Right there on top of the moon, we could sit and do nothing. I wish we were both to just fly away. I don't want to care. It's being I'm good alone. I'll be okay, miss you like a normal.